Hey, welcome back to another session of Paint This with Jerry Arnell right here at the Yarnell School of Fine Art. Boy, I am so happy that you were able to join us today. As promised, we're going to start a brand new painting, but what's going to make this so unique and fun is it's something that, well, I don't know if I've even ever done on TV before, maybe a long time ago, but it's going to be something that a lot of you have expressed interest in. Uh, as I've traveled around the country, I see different uh, versions of this kind of thing, and it's really a lot of fun. It's, it's not a gimmick by any stretch. It's an actual art form, and it's going to be something that where you combine two canvases together to create one. It's called a diptych. Now, these are acrylic paintings, and they're going to be on stretch canvases. They're going to be two small canvases, and this is all information based on the cards, letters, emails, the phone calls, visits we get from you all. Uh, we now have thousands of students all around the world. We love to hear from you, so please keep all those cards and letters coming in and let us know your ideas. I've got a lifetime left, I hope, of painting, and I'll be able to get them all in eventually. But right now, we're going to do this one, and this is going to be called A Bluebird's Paradise. Now, many of you have written, you love the bird segments. I love the bird segments. That's how I began my career. And so what we're going to do today is we're going to start one, and I'm going to show you how to put it all together. Now, I don't even know how long it's going to take, but we're just going to let it happen and kind of just let it unfold. Now, before we start, I want to show you an example of a diptych. Now, this is a painting. Actually, this is a paper print of one I did many years ago, back in 1987, actually. There's the date on it. And this is when I was working with Ducks Unlimited. This was a very large one. Now, a diptych just means two pieces brought together to create one. And what's kind of fun about it, like this one, when it's framed, and it's in two separate frames or one big one, and you have a centerpiece, it looks like you're looking through a window pane. And on this side, you see this group of duck, this duck, over here, you see these ducks coming in. You can see the tree in the middle was purposely designed so that it actually, if you could see the whole thing correctly, it would connect to this tree and come out. See how this limb comes out and runs over? So it creates a connecting point, you know, where they come together. You can frame them any way you want to. You can use them as a, a gallery wrap with no frame. You can put frames on them. You can mat them. These, when they're matted and with a the frame, they're just beautiful and they stretch out about four or five feet long. It's a great over the sofa painting or an office painting or something like that. So that's what a diptych is. Now there's also one called a triptych where you'd have three and there goes on and on and on. You can have several segmented pieces that are all kind of in the same, you know, might say theme, colors and so forth and so on. Well, what we're going to do is a bluebird's paradise. So I'm going to take these down. I just wanted you to see this so that you wouldn't think I was crazy because if you're not familiar with the art world, this would be a little bit challenging for you to understand. So 